I started on PD two and a half years ago, and I did put a lot of thought into whether to go with home hemo or, or PD. I chose PD because I felt, um, I believed it to be better um, and gentler on your body. You know, there are some advantages to peritoneal dialysis. Um, we know that people who are on PD, um, their own kidney function lasts a little bit longer. And whatever percentage of your own kidney function you have, that is extremely important. I've been on uh, peritoneal dialysis now for about 15 months and uh, uh, my generating kidneys, I have uh, polycystic kidneys, same as uh, my two brothers. Chemo seemed a bit harder on me. It, um, I had some side effects. And of course I was doing chemo, I was having to go to the hospital three times a week. What we really want is where possible, uh, people start with peritoneal dialysis if they're interested in doing dialysis at home. Starting off with PD for some of the advantages that we know it has early on. As I got into uh, more and more into the Kelowna renal uh, section there at the uh, hospital in Kelowna, the women there uh, talked to me about, um, you know, peritoneal dialysis and, and uh, just said it was a good option for somebody that's uh, able to do it, that somebody that's active and it's not only easier on your body, but it gives you a little bit more uh, freedom. So I, I was immediately interested in it and I did what research I could on it and uh, went through the training. The training I received, again, it, it's all reassuring. Lots of practice, um, start with the basics and, and just work your way slowly. It's not like, oh, you, you, they rush you through anything. It's not, it's, it's take your time. They don't want to send you off, not comfortable. It's a little confusing some days. So deep, my husband, to help me do it. Yeah, I can do. I think I'm gonna do okay. That he reminds me, I think I have to do something. Well, it's going good. I'm there for all the exchanges. Uh, she was in the hospital there, so none of the nurses was uh, really familiar with this. So I had to go in and help her because she couldn't really do it on her own and do her exchanges four times a day for her. And uh, now we're back home and things are going good. It does make me happy just to be able to be at home, continue working. I still work, but I mean, right now with PD, I can do it overnight. It, like, so I have the whole day free. I can get it a normal sleep time and normal work time. You know, it's, it's pretty, uh innocuous to have this machine working for seven hours and for the majority of the time you're asleep and uh, you wake up and you know unplug and you go about starting your day and it has little or, or, or no effect on your your day to day i definitely have had to adapt there's a few things i can't do like run but i've adapted i do other things now i bowl <laughs> you know uh, I kayak, I get somebody else to help me with the kayak though. To be in Prince George, like, we started to get our, know our way around down there, but it wasn't uh, uh, viable for us, you must well say, to move. We know everybody here. Yeah, it's better to be at home. At least you can get better. And that, it's someplace that's straight, you don't know the doctors, the nurses, or any of the people that you run into. I mean, if, if you live far away from a dialysis unit, it's going to be a big factor in your life. Um, you know, it's, it's scary enough and hard enough to be facing a serious illness, um, and then to have to travel, or in some cases, people have to move, um, which is, you know, a huge disruption in life. Our health nurse here on the reserve, uh, she comes over and uh, checks the wife out all the time. Plus my family's all here, not in Prince George. I did really like it when I was living. We were living in our camper there for almost three months. And I did like it. I don't like city life. It's too noisy. It, it's quite frustrating to sit at the hospital and um, have people have to take care of you all the time. and. 
it's so much nicer where you can take care of yourself and arrange your dialysis that fits your schedule more so than having to fit a schedule at the hospital. I'd recommend this to people that just want to be at home, close to family and stuff, without having to take four or five hours out of their day every day to go to the hospital to get the dialysis. And this seems to be working okay, like for us. Another fabulous thing about PD is there's a lot more flexibility in your diet.